Hi, hello and welcome to Sizzling Vidya channel. Today is going to be a very useful video which is about kitchen hob and chimney deep cleaning. You can see how dirty, sticky and greasy my chimney is. So my chimney is extremely dirty and I have not cleaned this for about 6 months now maybe. So it is so oily, greasy and sticky from the top and as well as from the bottom. For this I am making an all purpose cleaner. I am using an old spray bottle into which I am filling one part of dish liquid, one part of cleaning vinegar along with one part of water. After adding all the three, shake it well and make it into a good mixture. Spray this all-purpose cleaner and leave it for about 10 to 15 minutes. After 10 to 15 minutes, once they are soaked well on the greasy surface, use a regular dish washing scrubber to take the grease out of the chimney top. Since it is a glass top, it will be easy to remove the same. Now I am wiping it with a damp cloth which is a microfiber cloth. Now you can see it's already much clean and neat. Now I am using another dry white microfiber cloth to remove the excess moisture from that. To give a sparkling and a shiny effect, I am using Colin liquid and wiping it with a tissue paper. Now you can see that our chimney glass top is sparkling clean. This is my chimney filter which is dirty and extremely greasy. I am using my kitchen sink to clean this filter. I have locked the kitchen drain outlet. I am using this simple and secret ingredient which is this Drainex declogger which is available very commonly in all the supermarket. This will do magic without any effort. I have taken two packets of this, one packet for each side. I am adding the first packet on one side of this chimney filter. You can see that the powder has got completely stuck to the chimney because it is so oily and greasy. Same way, I am adding the another packet on the other side of the filter. To this we need to add boiling hot water. For this I am adding about 3 to 4 kettles of boiling water, maybe about around 3 liters of water in such a way that the filter is fully immersed in the hot water. You may also use a plastic tub or some other uh, container where your chimney filter can fit completely and can be well immersed. Now let this sit for about 10 to 15 minutes. In the meanwhile, let us clean the hob. The bottom portion of my hob is iron and the top portion of the hob is brass. So I am using a container in which all these burners can be well immersed. Into this container, I am going to add half cup of cleaning vinegar to it. Next, I am going to add about 2 tablespoons of pitambari powder and I will be adding half cup of water. I am going to leave this overnight for soaking. These metal stands can be washed using regular dish liquid. I am using the same all purpose cleaner which I used for cleaning the chimney. You may use a toothbrush or a metal cleaning brush to clean the inside parts of the hob. Now I am using a tissue paper to remove all the dirt that was inside.
Next, I am removing the knobs from my hob and cleaning them and wiping them with a damp cloth and a tissue paper and fixing them back. After around 15 minutes of soaking, you can see the color of the water. All the oiliness and greasiness have got mixed with the hot boiling water. Now I am using a metal cleaning brush to scrub all the grooves of the filter. Please note that the hot water is still boiling hot and don't burn your hands. I am using a tong here to flip the filter to the other side. I am opening my sink to drain out the dirty water. This way the kitchen sink also gets declogged. Now using a regular dish soap, I am cleaning the filter and leaving it to dry. After soaking it overnight, you can see the color difference in the burner. By using the dish soap, gently scrub it on all sides. Use a metal cleaning brush to declog the pores of the burner. Do it the same way for all the burners. So now let's see the before versus after. Now you can see how fresh and new is the hob looking. Please note that the burner will turn black upon usage maybe in a week's time or 10 days. However, you may do this regularly to retain the brass color of the burner. The filter is sparkling clean and the chimney is shining with freshness. By following this simple cleaning procedure, your chimney and hob will look brand new as a store-bought one. If you found this video to be useful, then please hit a like and share it with your friends and family and don't forget to subscribe to Sizzling with your channel. Follow me on Facebook and Instagram and I'll see you all in the next video. Until then, bye-bye and thanks for watching.